So many people are scared of Mashiach. What's going to be? Life is going to be different. Wars, Gog and Magog. Leave that all aside. Because what, what over, outweighs all of them is the fact that Mashiach will be here, Hashem will have a home. We're mourning because Hashem doesn't have a home. Baruch Hashem, after this event, we'll all go back to our homes. God doesn't have a home. What do you mean? But God is all over the place. Yes, but Hashem wants to reside in one specific home that's the Beit HaMikdash. So with everything going on, with all the tragedies that we heard with the pandemic and with Meron and with Stalin and with, uh, with the Surfside uh, uh, tragedy that happened, but one thing we have to know, when Mashiach comes, it's going to be a life of bliss, of happiness, and it's going to outweigh all the tragedies that we heard. So no, it's just the Adra, but just the opposite. We want Mashiach. Let, let whatever come our way, let it come our way. We're ready to take Mashiach because when we know that's the greatest thing that's going to happen to us, Mashiach is the greatest thing that will happen to us, then we'll yearn for Mashiach more. We'll pray for Mashiach more. We'll put a little bit more kavanah, more emphasis and passion and desire in our mitzvot. 